Give me my crutch, big daddy. Why do you drink? I don't know. Now give me my crutch. I'm trying to think of why you drink or give up drinking. Can you please give me my crutch so I can get off of this floor? Why are you drinking? Why are you throwing your life away like something disgusting you pick up on, on the street? Big daddy, I'm in pain. I stepped on my foot. Good. I'm glad I'm not too numb with the liquor in you to feel some pain. You just spilled my drink. I'll make a bargain with you. You tell me why you drink, and I'll pour you the liquor. Don't know why now. Give me my crutch. You heard me. You tell me what I asked you first. Give me a drink first, and I'll tell you. Tell me first. I'll tell you in what word, in one word. What word? Disgust. Now, how about that drink? What are you disgust with? Otherwise, being disgusted don't make no sense. Give me my crutch. You have to tell me what I asked you. I told you to kill my disgust. Disgust with what? You drive a hard bargain. Tell me why you drink, and I'll pass you the liquor. Have you ever heard of the word mendacity? Sure. Mendacity is one of the five dollar words she politicians, politicians throw back and forth at each other. You know what it means? Don't it mean lying and liars? Yes, sir. Lying and liars. Has someone been lying to you? Has Margaret been lying to you, Brick? No, sir. That wouldn't matter. Then who's been lying to you, and what about it? Not one single person, and not one lie. What then? Then what, for Christ's sake? Just the whole... The whole thing. Why are you rubbing your head? You got a headache? No, no, I'm just, I'm just trying to... Just... Concentrate? But you can't, because your brain's all soaked up with liquor. Ain't that the truth, wet brain? What do you know about mendacity? I can write a book on it, don't you know that? I read a whole book and still not cover the subject near enough. Pretenses. Ain't that mendacity? Having, for instance, to act like I care for Big Mama. I haven't been able to stand the sight, the smell, or sound of that woman 40 years now. Even when I laid her, regular as a piston. Church, pours with Jesus on me. But I go. I go and sit there and listen to that fool preacher. You I do like for some reason. Always did have some kind of feeling for it. Affection, respect. Yeah, always. You, being a success as a planter is all I had any devotion for my entire life. I live with mendacity. Why can't you? There's nothing else but mendacity to live for, is there? Yes, sir, there's something else to live for. What? This. Liquor. That's not living. That's dodging away from life. Maybe I want to dodge away from life. Then why don't you kill yourself, man? Because I like to drink. I can't talk to you. No, I'm sorry, big daddy. Not as sorry as I am. I'll tell you something. A little while back when I thought my number was up, I thought about you. Should I or should I not give this place to you when I go? Since I hate Gooper and man, those five same monkeys are theirs and why should I give up 28,000 acres of the richest land this side of the Valley Nile to not my kind? But on the other hand, Brick, why should I give it to you? Why should I give it to a goddamn fool on the bottle? Liked or not liked, who maybe even loved. So I just don't understand this. No, I understand, Big Daddy. Well, if you do, you're smarter than I am, because I don't. I'll, I will tell you this, frankly. I still haven't made up my mind on that question. And still to this day, I haven't made up no will. But now I don't have to. The pressure is gone. I can just wait and see if you pull yourself together or if you don't. That's right, Big Daddy. You sound like you thought I was kidding. No, sir. I know you're not. But you don't care? No. Nope. No, I don't. Now, how about taking a look at your birthday fireworks and seeing that cool breeze off the river? Wait, Brick, let's not leave it like this. Like all the mother talks we've had. We just talked around things for some rotten reason. Like something was left not spoken. Like one of us was neither, neither of us was honest to the other. Yeah, I've never lied to you, Big Daddy. Did I ever to you? 
No, sir. There's at least two people that never lied to each other. But we've never talked with each other. We can now. Big Daddy, they don't seem to be much of anything else to say. You say you drink to kill your disgust. You said to give you a reason. Is liquor the only thing that will kill this disgust? For now, yes. <laughs>